It's me again. I'm going to do a, a much better review of a pixel protector. And I'd also like to thank B-E-L-L-O-W-E-R, number 10. Hope I said that right. I try to remember everyone's name, but it, it's not easy sometimes. But thank you again for reminding me about the pixel protector. And I hope this reveal will help some people that are having burn-in with their LCDs, their uh, plasma, their DLP, or whatever they're called. This really helps, though. Anyway, let's start the DVD up here. Let me, let me uh, put this on here. Go in, Mr. CD. I'm going to show you some of the features we got here on the pixel protector. Hope my camera's straight, because I'm not near it. Turn it up a little bit. Music's not that bad either. Got a nice little catch to it. This came all the way from the UK. I'll tell you, those people in the UK, they are smart. How come people in America can't make a product like this? Because they're stupid. Well, not everyone's stupid. We got some smart people over there in the UK. Then you got music playing in the menu right here. You got test display patterns, alignment tests, screen washes, and screen savers. I guess first we'll go to screen washes. This is what helps get rid of your burn in. You've got a snow wash. It looks kind of like you've lost your cable. You can run it up to four hours. This image, it'll stay there forever, so you don't have to go and restart it. The only way you can stop it is press a menu on your DVD remote or take out the CD. So that's one screen wash. And then you've got your color wash, which is a bunch of colors moving. They recommend you do it for two hours. Now, I did this every single day for a couple of weeks. I just left an image like that and it, it seemed to work. It just has a bunch of images moving around to help get rid of your burn in. And I'll show you the other one. It's just a whitewash. Nothing but a white picture. It also says do it for two hours, but you can do it as long as you want. That's just a nice, bright, white screen there. They also say turn up your contrast and your brightness to make it get rid of burning even better. And then you got screen savers. You get three of them. You get smoky. Looks kind of smoky. Looks more like a little plant if you ask me. It looks kind of like a flower. That just moves around. You got that one. And then you've got spiral and vortex. I like this one. It looks kind of like DNA or something out of a science experiment. And those continue forever until you press menu. And then you've got uh, the vortex one. I'll go ahead and show you that one. This one looks pretty neat, I'd say. I like this one. It's just a bunch of... feels like you're going down a tunnel. But did a good job on this DVD, though. You've also got uh, display test patterns. You can check your color on your TV and you adjust it with your other remote while it's going. It just plays a, a bunch of color performance things. It checks the color on your TV and you see if it looks fine and all that. I'll fast forward it so you can see more of the picture in there. It turns blue there for a second and it goes to black and white and all those colors and all that. But it looks like my color is fine because it shows up pretty good. And you just got all those shapes and all that and just test your color out. If you want to adjust it though, you just use your other remote and mess with your color bar settings and all that. There's a guide to it that tells you how to do it all on the DVD, but it's not hard. Even a caveman can do it. Well, I don't know. Maybe a caveman couldn't do it. Then you got overcast scan tests. This this uh, pixel protector will work on any kind of TV. It also works on my dad's TV. All you gotta have is a DVD player, so it's easy as that. It doesn't 
void your TV warranty or anything. That right there is telling you your lines and all that. It's going over what your screen can do and all that. And uh, I think that's pretty much it on this DVD. So you've got a... Oh wait, no, there's a alignment test too. Screen alignment and LCD pro projector and alignment and all that. You've also got some extras on here. You got a hookup guide. Uh, play test photos. I go ahead and play these for you. Some of these look pretty neat. Nice little volcano erupting there. There's an apple with some cinnamon next to it. <laughs> There's a cat. You know I love cats. I got five cats. There's a turtle. I used to have pet turtles. Then they all ran away. One of them, his name was Snappy. He was a snapping turtle. There's the earth. And a fake little moon go with it. Or the sun. I guess you could say that's the sun. There's someone's eyeball. Which, of course, has been photoshopped. Because nobody's eyeballs that color. Unless you're a mutant from Hills Have Eyes. There's a butterfly. There's some uh, jelly beans, I guess. I don't like those. Those give me a stomachache. They make me sick. Oh, that looks nice. I'd like to go there one day. Watch out for uh, the sharks, though. Hey, there's my uh, my cat's cousin, Mr. Tiger. I'd like to be near one of those things. He'd eat you up in one second. Oh, there's a hot lady eating uh, a strawberry. Why don't you just eat the whole thing? Sit there and take one bite. There's evidently a lady that shaved her head. Don't have a whole lot of hair left. She's evidently giving you the hand. There's a nice little beach scene. Let's fast forward a little bit here. There's a view of the top of the world. And that's it. But this is a great way to protect your screen. If you got burn-in problems, I highly recommend it. They got great customer service, unlike Microsoft. They're very helpful. They sent this pretty quick to me, I say that. It only took about about a week, I believe. Came all the way from the UK. It was, I believe I paid forty dollars, but it is highly worth it if it saves your TV screen. Well that's all I got to say about Pixel Protector. Thanks for watching and uh thanks for reminding me again. B E L L O W E R number ten. Hope I said that right. The lower 10. I guess that's how you say it. Well, thanks for watching. Y'all have a nice day, and I'll, I'll see you later. And uh, Thanks for watching this review of uh, Pixel Protector again. I think this version's better than the other one, because, well, I went in more detail. Well, thanks for watching. Have a nice day, and uh, I hope your TV won't have burn-in problems and all that other stuff. Bye-bye.